Okay, I'm um, going to make actually how bulletproof coffee should be made. This is the original traditional method, the original style. Okay, watch carefully. So first off, we get the mug and we need some butter. Now the butter has to go into the mug. So you get the in get your butter into your mug. There you go. Got to get the butter right in there. Okay, because in, in, in the modern method, the method that's being promoted at the moment, you simply can't get enough butter into your coffee. This is the main drawback, as I understand it, of the current method of bulletproof coffee. So, <clears throat> that's about the right amount of butter. Now we need to make a little hole down the middle. So you need a wooden spatula. Stick the handle down the middle. And extract it. You can see there. That's vitally important that you get this right. Okay, next step guys, espresso cup. Follow me to the coffee machine. Fully loaded. Let's do this, here it comes. You're looking for 18 to 23 seconds extraction and you're looking for a rat's tail. The consistency on the crema must be thick enough to pull it in slightly. That's not bad, it's not brilliant, but it'll do. Good. Nice. There it is, you see the coffee over here, follow me. Okay, now then, you need one of these, it's a Calpol syringe. Draw your coffee up. There it is, beautiful. In you go, inject the coffee into your butter. Should melt a little as we go, keep it coming. Steady, steady away. Come on now. We need to get this amount of coffee in there. That'll do. Okay, I can get a bit more in there. What you're getting now is the exact ratio of caffeine to butter fatty acids. Nice. Let's just pour some of that excess off. Nice, good. And then we top that off with a butter cap. There. Tuck in, that'll give you energy Till, let's say you have this at 6 in the morning, this will be non-stop energy till at least, I'd say at least lunchtime. Okay, enjoy.